Well, the... That's that. Are there, like, no dungeons where you, like, go down deep into these and, like, do multiple levels? I feel like there are. From the vague amount of stuff I know about the first set of Dot .hat games, I, I believe there was. Experience points, did we? No, but these excursions aren't so bad every now and then. I'm so glad. I don't really care much for simple level raising. That's not why I play the game. If you're always concerned with numbers, then you won't notice all the beautiful things around you. And that would be a real shame. Hey, have you ever been to the arena? Like, fighting it? No, I haven't. I find the whole idea of players fighting against each other kind of scary, really. Is it? Defeating other people just so you can build up your rank? Well, to be blunt, I hate that kind of thing. I hate this so much. But, you know, I think it would be good for you to learn a little bit more about the world. Can I ask you something, Haseo? What? Do you really enjoy winning over other people? What are you talking about? Yeah, who doesn't? <laughs> I don't. Or rather, I've never really had a chance to win anything yet. But I do know what it feels like to lose. And how painful that can be. This place. It was used as a quest when I just started playing. It was a time attack quest. I came in dead last because of the way I am. And everybody laughed and made fun of me. Since then, I stopped participating in competitive events. So, that's why you don't like the arena. It's not just the arena. Having a higher level than others, finding better weapons than others, so what is that supposed to prove? I mean, <laughs> you to your just to show off your power. Well, it's only natural for players to want to be strong in an RPG, right? Yeah, but Haseo, there's no goal in that. Personally, I think it's also really important for us to slow down and and stop. Oh my God. And to oh enjoy God. things like flowers blooming around your ankles. Oh my fucking nice God. Nice things like meeting all sorts of new people. Holy shit. Slow down? Stop and to enjoy? <laughs> it's impossible. I can't take this anymore. Let it out, man. Are you an idiot? Yeah! All of this. All of this! All of this! Is nothing more than a bunch of computer data! Thank Just you! a bunch of fake stuff made by slapping textures on top of polygons! How the hell do you find any part of this made-up world beautiful? Haseo! <gasps> There's only one thing that's real about this world! And that's us, the players! Getting stronger and defeating your opponent! Those are the ways that all of us keep connected! That's the way this game is played! What's wrong with that, huh? Answer me! Tell me, what's wrong with that? I... I... Leave. Damn, you're so irritating! Don't show your face again! <gasps> Damn it! 
Don't go telling me crap like, slow down, with Shino's face. Alright, so, first off, I don't think he should have yelled at her to the point of, yo, fuck off and don't show your face to me. That's a little, that's a little rough. That's a little unnecessary, young man. However, holy shit, this bitch, guys. <laughs> holy shit. Uh, hi, everybody. Um, I decided that I wanted to play the RPG where the point is leveling up and getting gear and progressing. And I decided to not do any of that because I'm a fucking bitch. <laughs> I lost once and, well, I just, I just want to help people. And, and I, why am I playing video games? <laughs> I have never experienced a more boring character in, in one of these games before. I have not experienced someone who I went, holy shit, I'm dying. I'm dying. And she kept going with her speech and going and going, and I'm like, well, so much for the third this player for the can't arena. be real. This can't be real. Might as well go back to Canards at home and report. I was in awe. I felt my soul start to leave my body. Like... Good Christ, man. And my worry was she'd say no. Who woulda who would have thought we did we wouldn't even get a chance to have that part of the discourse. Instead, instead we had so much more to talk about. And by talk about, she had so much so many things to preach that are so unbelievably dumb. It's like, I can see the beauty in a video game. I can get sentimental the way she does about a game. Like, look at how beautiful this is. Not in the roleplay sense where she's like, look at this and it did this and this and the sorrow of the things being built here. No, it's like marveling at how good something looks and getting immersed within the game. She, she's fucking nuts. But, man, is she a fucking psycho. <laughs> and boring. There's no goal to leveling up? Sorry. The uh, third person for the arena just didn't work out. <sighs> no surprise. Clerics are in great demand with the next tournament so close. We really need another member. Oh! Well, what is it? Let's recruit one in the forums. Oh. There you go. Good idea. Okay. I'll get on posting something on the forums. Thanks. I'll send you an email after I post, so look for it on the official forum. Nah, it's a reason for us to finally hit up the forum for the first time. And we have emails. All right. Well, now that I can ignore the unbelievably boring girl, we can do something else. Alright, can we, can we talk about how every girl in this game is fucking bad? Adelie is way too into not being about fun at all. Pi acts like an uppity bitch. Uh, Saku, I believe, which is the other person controlling that one account, is, well... Thirsty way too hard in the wrong way. And the other... Uh, and our, our, our girlfriend's dead. <laughs> so she's bad because she died. <laughs> she's in a coma, I get it. Member wanted. Uh, okay, let's um... I believe we get to the forms just by um... Wait, no, it's right here. I thought it was in the um... The other thing. Let's see, uh, the world. Anyone opening chests? Red mark. Epitaph. I miss R1. Hmm. Crimson versus?
It might be the it might be the game itself because I did see a forum option there, so it might be different from this one. Yeah, here we go. Probably wasn't the best idea to have like two forums there. Invitation to clerics. Looking for a cleric. Here's a message from our leader. Hello, I'm Haseo, and I'm a rogue. I'm looking for a cleric to join me in the arena. We're here to have fun and be happy. We're hoping to create a party that's thoughtful and considerate. We don't care if you're a guy or a girl. Hoping to hear from you. Haseo didn't say any of this. <laughs> I'd never say anything like this. <laughs> it's getting scary how linked we are. I'd rather die than use emoticons like that. <laughs> Syllabus. I'ma get ya. Hmm, do we back out and then maybe get something, or... Yep. That worked. Response. We got a response, good shit. <laughs> okay, let's go on the fucking forum again. Oh my lord. I mean, I guess this is how that would work. It's not like we got a refresh button. They got rid of that at some point. In this weird future. Sakura. I wouldn't mind joining you in the arena. I'll be near the beast statue in Gallant Seasons Dr <laughs> It's... By the end? These... By the end they use one keyword that makes it sound ridiculous. And please come by yourself. Okay. So I gotta solo joke. this. Anyway... I guess I'd better go meet up with this person first. The place is the beast statue located at Delta Gallant Seasons Drunkard. <laughs> so fucking stupid. Log me in, boys. Potential member is waiting. I've got to hurry on over to the beast statue at Delta. Okay. Take me in. Go away. Did she actually just try to get to me? After me telling you that you must leave this world forever and never show yourself to me, the first she's like, Mikhail, I've come to be boring again. No. You must improve yourself as a person and play this video game the right way. Otherwise, be gone. Your place isn't here. You garbage. You garbage mortal. <laughs> and that's how I feel about her right now. Not really, I'm just joking. But good lord, is she boring. I'm sure she's nice IRL. I bet if I met her, met her in real life, we'd hit it off really great. She'd be awesome. She'd be like, hey... Do these pants look good on me? And I'd be like, Yas, queen! I'm sorry, this is my new innovative way of trying to curse my own audience. <coughs> well. Man, why do I taste blood? Anyway, uh... That was a dead end, so I guess we gotta go up instead. I guess we could hug this. I don't want to do any fights. For for the obvious reasons of I don't care. Damn, this is bad. Fuck off! Fuck off, you bastards! I was given some stuff earlier. I should be able to run using it. Smoke screen. Well, that is actually super useful. I was expecting, like, a super pronounced, like, animation to that. And it just went, nope, you're out. One thing I gotta give this game is how snappy it is with, like, everything that it does. It doesn't really waste much time with its animations and its presentation, which I think is really cool. I remember Dot Hack being pretty big pre-release, like the originals, because I remember going to, like, um... I remember going to GameStop, this was, of course, when it was the uh, original four games. And I, um... I'm about to have a stroke. I remember going and seeing um, the playing like videos of it. I think they might have shown like some of the anime related stuff for it. Cause I remember the 
this was that weird thing where parts of those games you won't understand unless you watch like anime OVAs and some other crap and that heck super weird like that but it's like I like Kingdom Hearts so you know glass house um, but I remember seeing a lot of stuff about it and people saying yeah you play the game then in the next one it carries over your stuff at least I like vaguely remember people saying like you know you gotta buy a memory card for this one like <laughs> fucking of course you do gotta buy, buy it for every one of them I am so blessed that my family when picking up a PS2 and a copy of the first Kingdom Hearts cuz yo Disney looks okay, cool when they did that for me that they were smart we were smart enough to get that research of yeah we're gonna need that memory that memory thing so that he can play these games properly cuz I can't imagine people who picked up like those machines and then had to play the same shit over and over again because you couldn't save. What a nightmare. Second block. Huh. So this is the first dungeon that has an extension to it. Whoa, this room is big. Big and spacious. Hmm. Anyone? Did anyone actually get like a, a system where you weren't able to like save or anything when you, whenever you wanted to save a game? Like, sound off in the comments down below. I guess. Talk about your horror stories with that. I do have some. But it was mostly like the N64 days. Uh, I did never ended up getting the uh, the uh, controller pack I guess it was called that would let you save uh, speaking speaking of not having things I don't have any fucking battery life left but um I remember there were certain games where they required you to have it and that was like the worst I think I think the Tony Hawk on N64 didn't have it Rayman 2 definitely didn't have it because I remember struggling with that and going, I gotta do this entire thing in one sitting, which seems crazy. And I'm someone who doesn't really know the tech behind it, but I feel like back then, the fact that, you know, stuff wasn't saving to cartridge seemed like a big, seems like a big oversight in hindsight. Just because you saw stuff on SNES be able to easily save your data. So it seemed kind of weird that it wasn't, you know, a standard thing. At least in terms of cartridges. But then, you know, there's the idea that cartridges end up taking up more. You need to get more expensive cartridges with specific tech if you want to have them, like, saving and all that. Now we don't have to worry about any of that shit. Now we're free to play whatever we want. It's, it's auto-saving and cloud-saving. Well, I guess we're here. I soon when I saw the nice carpeting. You're late. I've been waiting for you for quite a while now. <sighs> it's you guys. You again. probably shouldn't have put my I real wish name I could on say this. It's all because of my love for you, but this time it's strictly business. Business. It looks like you went and pissed off some more of the wrong people. It's a pretty foolish move to challenge the Arena Emperor. You! How do you know about that? Just so you know, I'm not the only one who's dying to get a piece of you. And now, not only did I not have to set you up, but I even get paid to kill the poor misguided terror of death. It's so perfect, it's almost scary. You mean... You replied to the post? Oh, damn it! Hold it right there, PKers. Huh? Oh my. Tell me, what would one of the top Moon Tree members be doing in a place like this? I've come to talk about proper online etiquette with wild, mannerless players like you. Whatever. 
How about I be generous and PK the whole lot of you? That would only cause more problems for you. You see, we of Moon Tree are prohibited from attacking other players. However, defense against unjust violence is another story. Yeah, it ain't prohibited at all, damn low lives. Now bring it on! Go ahead! Just try and kill me! Don't get hasty, Matsu. I know, Sakaki. There's no need to worry. I'm not gonna attack first. <laughs> I believe that you are a part of Kestrel, are you not? I have heard that the guild master of Kestrel, Gabi, is a tolerant man. But he doesn't endorse player kills, does he? If he finds out that you unjustly tried to PK members of Moon Tree, he will have no choice but to instigate disciplinary measures on you, isn't that right? <gasps> or. Are you particularly special to Master Gabi, Miss Bordeaux? <sighs> Damn. Fine. I am happy to see that you understand me so quickly. Furthermore, Haseo... ...is a friend of Atelier, one of us. May I ask you to refrain from trying to PK him as well? <sighs> I haven't heard a reply. All right, fine, whatever. I won't PK him. That's all you need, right? Good. But arena battles are an exception. But of course, that makes sense. Arena battles are conducted with both participants' consent. Do you hear that, Haseo? You had better be ready when you come to the arena. You can relax now. After all, they are not so stupid as to risk their own positions within their guild. You've got the whole Hero of Justice thing down. Is that your character, or really you? We only did what any other online game player would have done for another player in need. <laughs> I am no hero of justice. I don't know. You guys seem a little too deliberate. And you've got the timing down perfect. The reason why we made it here in time is because Atelier received advanced warning. Advanced warning? You! Yes! That little boy from the shop told me. Excuse me, yes? I was wondering, you're friends with Haseo, aren't you? Uh, well, aren't you? That's right. Yes, I am Haseo's friend. Don't lie. Please, you gotta help him. He needs your help right now. He needs my help? But what's the matter? What's going on? That was a hard cut. The one who wrote the fake response and the one who hired the PKer was in fact his twin sister. Saku? Yes. He said that his sister is sleeping right now, so. Anyway, I didn't want to do anything by myself, so I called Sakaki. I'm glad he made it. So, when the hell did I ever say that I needed you to help me, huh? Haseo! How rude of you. Don't you realize that Atali is the one who is responsible for saving you? The very least you can do is thank her. Okay, fine. Thank you. Now you happy? What an incredibly small-hearted person you are. I'm quite saddened. Well, putting that aside, it would seem that a lot has been happening to you lately, Haseo. If you have any trouble you would like help with, feel free to rely on any one of us at any time. No thanks. I'd feel like I was brainwashed for asking. You bastard! You've got some nerve. How dare you talk to Sakaki like that! Be still, Matsu. 
But this guy... Haseo, isn't it hard for you to think of everyone you meet in this game as an enemy? I find that it's much easier to depend on one another and to understand one another. Don't you agree? I'm not interested in you or your religion. You. Matsu. Uh, yes, sir. Sorry. Haseo, I would very much like for you and I to be able to understand each other better. Sorry, not interested. It's not like I need you guys. That is a shame. Very well, then. But I do hope that you will change your mind before we meet again. Thank you very much, Sakaki. Um... Hmm? I'm sorry about all those obnoxious things I said earlier. Fine. I'm really, really sorry. Huh. Well, that was a total waste of time, wasn't it? At this rate, I'm never going to be able to participate in the arena. Oh, yes, you were searching for someone on the forums. You need just one more person, right? Yeah. Then I'll do it. I'll fight with you. Okay, I forgive you for being absolute trash. I guess. I am. But I thought you hated that whole winning losing thing. I do, but I thought about it and I realized that it's no good for me just to force Moon Tree on you. I also have to try and understand you, as well as the arena and battles and everything else like that. Besides, is it really so strange, so bad for me to want to know what the taste of victory is like for once in my life? No, I think it's great that you want that. All right, then. I'll let you taste it. You'll experience the joy of victory. <laughs> she did a happy face. She is now a member of Ken Aird. <laughs> I'll see you later then. Yeah. Well, that's all done. Picked up Fire Wheel. Is that just like a, an attack thing? No, no, it's a bunch of different weapon types. But it looks like we're only allowed to equip these types. You can't like multi-class, which is kind of lame. Would have liked the ability to like use different weapons, because I'm already starting to get a little... I need, I need more to chew on with this combat. So I'm hoping we can uh, get further, but... We, we were set to level 1. This tends to happen. Yeah, give me that D. I totally didn't earn anything. Alright. Well, she's officially forgiven for agreeing to be in the arena. Because as it's known, I needed her character to not be mo the most boring thing on the planet. She's no longer boring because she wants to be out of her comfort zone. Now next time... Uh, we'll check our mail and see what's going on. I guess I'll maybe try and grind out a level or two in between then, can I? I mean, I can do it with these two. If I wanted to, I don't know. I may not even do that. Maybe I'm crazy. Whatever, we're done. I'll see you next time.